the slightly younger man, Naramani, at 28, the slightly shorter as well, 7, 2 and 0, 10, 6 and 0, Petley, one of our most capped Bama competitors. This one has real, real potential. Bama fans, fight fans, this is the Night of Champions, and we get ready for three five-minute rounds in Bama's featherweight division. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner, an all-arounder standing five feet, eight inches tall, and weighed in at 145.6 pounds. He has an impressive record of seven wins, two losses, and zero draws. Representing Iron Man MMA, all the way from Bristol, England, Nad Narimani. And his opponent, standing in the right corner, an MMA specialist standing five feet, nine inches tall, and weighed in at 144.2 pounds. Also an impressive record of 10 wins, six losses and one draw, with four of those wins by submission. Representing London Fight Factory from London, England, by way of Victoria, British Columbia, Canada, Jeremy Ninja Petley. When the action begins, your referee in charge, Mark Woodard. So, Chris, when we talk of entertainers, you heard the crowd's response to Petley. They love watching this man compete. And Petley, with a nice left cross there, finishing with a round kick. And you can immediately see why these are two of the very best in Europe in this weight class. Oh, Petley, I was saying, looking sharp, and then he got caught, and you saw the raw power of Nat there. And Naramani now charging forward. I think he's going to look to set up that piston of a right hand. Petley, I think, needs to keep circling, but being very wary of circling left. That's right, because we've seen the dangers earlier on this incredible card of circling what we call the wrong way into the opponent's powerful hand, and it can be absolutely devastating. And Petley cracked him with a nice left cross, very deep left cross. Now showing the rear teeth is Nad. And again, Petley, very sharp, in and out, throwing his punches. You get the feeling he needs to be. Very important when you've got a guy like Naramani swinging for the fences on the other end of the trigger. And Naramani, short hooks. Watch for him when he feels the distance is there to really open up and torque down on those punches. Yes, Petley really tightens up his guard when Naramani is in the pocket. And I like how Petley Staying very disciplined off a of probing jab, keeping those elbows tight. But he's got to keep his left hand high enough that he doesn't get clipped. Yes, fast start from both men. Both their feet planted, they're flat-footed here, so they're looking to key up everything with power. But that right hand, public enemy number one of a southpaw fighter from Nad, and it hits him to the body. Right cross, number two, to the midsection from Naramani. Low kick from Petley in response here. Oh, a nice high kick from Naramani. These two are so economical in their movements and motion. Right cross again for Nad. Petley got clipped there. He's got to be careful. I said these are two... Oh, that wasn't a clip. That was a hard, hard right hand. That's this could it. be all over, Chris. That's it. That's it. That's it. That's the end of the fight right there. That's got to be the end. And the right going underneath the guard of Petley, but Petley stands back up. Oh, now Whoa. the chopping elbows, and Petley somehow, oh no, this surely is it now. Stop He's turning away in the it. knee. That's Mark Woodard's over. seen enough. Man, now Naramani, ladies and gentlemen. He was an animal when he got the finish, Chris. He was relentless. How Jeremy Petley survived what he did, and then Naramani turned it up another gear and was vicious. What an entrance here in round number one from Nat Naramani. And all credit to Petley, he's as tough as they come, Malcolm. He, going off those previous performances, was able to really establish himself. But Nat Naramani was just too much. Chris, you warned about his power, but he displayed it so viciously, but accurately as well. Like I said, the right cross is 
the number one thing you got to be worried about is a southpaw fighter. And he snuck that thing in there right between the elbows of Petley. How Petley stayed in there after that barrage, I still don't know. And look at it, Chris. It's still coming. It's still coming. And then eventually Mark Woodard says, do you know what? No, no more. That knee was it. But you called it so correctly, Chris. What a finisher this man is. And seizing the opportunity is Nad Naramani, world-class talent here in the featherweight division to stop a guy like Petley in such a manner here in round number one. That's about as good a day at the office as it gets here in Panama, Malcolm. Ladies and gentlemen, make some noise for our fighters, come on! This bout ended 2 minutes 26 seconds of the first round. Your winner by TKO in the blue corner, Nad Narimani!